Hey, what's going on out there, YouTube? You know, I really don't want to make this video today. But I'm really just getting tired of all the ignorance and, and, and all the, all the, just, I, I can't take anymore. I can't listen to this crap anymore. I don't watch the news for a reason because I don't like the way they try to manipulate me and try to control me through my feelings and my psyche. I, I just, I'm so sick of it. First off, why are people even looking up to these false idols anyways? You know, athletes. Overgrown men that play with balls. I don't give a fuck what color you are. You're an overgrown man that plays children activities. Okay? Big deal. Big deal. Alright? Let's go ahead and get into this video here and let's, let's, just let's listen to this bullshit. All the left and the media tech dogs can dish it out, can't they? But they sure can't take it. Last night, we played clips of NBA superstars LeBron James, Kevin Durant, and an ESPN co host named Kerry Champion trashing Trump. The number one job in America, the point of person, is someone who doesn't understand the people and really don't give a about the people. I feel like our team as a as a country is not ran by a great coach. It's not even a surprise when he says something. It's not even a surprise. It's like laughable. It's like, it's that's laughable. Bad. It's laughable, laughable and it's it scary. Is. Okay, first off, look, you guys really think that Trump's not part of the establishment? You really think that, that Trump just came in and he's not part of the establishment and he just protected him, whatever? You people are that, you people are serious about this? You don't think that LeBron James and Kevin Durant don't know? That Trump is a part of the establishment? Trump goes along with all this stuff. You're being played. LeBron James is playing you. Donald Trump is playing you. They are all playing you together. They're playing on your emotions. You can't see what's going on here? Donald Trump was selected. Donald Trump is being used to divide the country by the people that's in charge. The people that they don't talk about. You can get rid of Donald Trump, but it ain't going to matter. The problems are still going to be there. How can this man be solely responsible for everything that's going wrong in America when all these problems were here before this guy got here? Can someone please explain this logic to me? First off, I don't understand why we're looking at these athletes anyways, crying. What do you guys do? You dribble balls. You shoot in a basketball hoop. Cool. Cool. You're not an inspiration to me. You're not an inspiration to anybody in my family because you're a false idol and you're a false prophet. Jesus Christ is king, and that's all I need to look to. I don't believe in Donald Trump. I don't believe in LeBron James. I don't believe in Lauren Ingram. Okay? First off, why are you people getting your news from a, an organization that's owned by Saudi Arabia? Talking about fake news. Own stakes in what? Fox, Time Warner, Citigroup, Twitter, Apple, Motorola. And you guys can't see what's going on. This isn't even an American-owned company. Let's listen to LeBron James' reply. Definitely not uh, shut up and dribble. Um, I would definitely not do that. I mean too much to... Um, um, to society, I mean too much to the youth, I mean too You don't mean anything to me, okay? And you shouldn't mean anything to society, bro. All right? Go home, take care of your family like you're supposed to do. All right? That's cool if your kids look up to you. That's, that's perfect. But my kids should be looking up to me, not you. You're a false idol, bro. They don't look up to Donald Trump, that fool either. Do you understand? Do you Before you attack me with your simple comments and act like it's the greatest thing anybody ever said all the time, your little childlike comments that I have to sit here and argue with adults all the time and child logic, it's just mind-blowing. Too much to, the, uh, to, to so many kids that feel like they don't have a... Um they don't have a way out and they need someone to help lead them out of the situation they're in. And, and that's why I would not sh just shut up and dribble because I, I mean too much to my two boys here, their best friend right here. 
my daughter that's at home, uh, my wife, my family, and all these other kids that look up to me for inspiration and trying to find a way out. A way out? Where'd you go? What, what, what did you do? What are you talking about? What, you moved to the hills with the rest of the athletes? Okay, okay, that's right. You guys care so much about your communities, right? You care so much about your communities. What, because you give out shoes and bikes? My lord. Seriously? All the money you athletes make. How about you go back to your communities and start building schools, recreational centers, businesses, but you don't. You don't do a damn thing. What you do is you leave the poor communities and you go live in the rich communities with all the people that you're sitting around here complaining about. And you don't do a damn thing but run your mouth. You play the game. You play the game that everybody else is playing. You can't see what's going on here, people? You're being played by everybody in the game. Donald Trump knows exactly what to say to get everybody all stirred up like clockwork. That man's no fool. He does it on purpose. Because that's his role. That's what he's being used to do. He gets up here and talks about fake news stories, fake articles. Acts like they're real. The only thing Donald Trump has done was made people believe in the government again because they were losing control. And you guys really honestly think that this guy isn't part of the establishment. It's fucking hilarious to me. You are children. It's time to grow up. Turn off the TV, get an independent thought, and start thinking for yourselves. Because this is ridiculous. I can't take it anymore. I'm sorry that I'm upset and I'm frustrated. But I can't sit here and listen to this diversion and all this segregation anymore. Because everybody that's talking, all they're doing is segregating people. I don't care. If you have a problem with America, then don't go play ball. Hey, Trump, if you got a problem with everybody, then leave. You guys can all go together somewhere. I don't care. We don't need none of you. We don't need none of you. You get it? Sit down and shut up. I'm so tired of the crying and the whining and the complaining. It's the same song and dance over and over and over, and nobody does a damn thing about it. All you guys do is, is, is talk about each other, make fun of each other, like a bunch of little children. Give me a break. Please leave your comments below, like, share, and subscribe. I'm out.